which country should I live in to the Don't Get Pretty Kids Part 2. Yeah, in Sweden, where I grew up, uh, I told you they threw me out of school, but many other things happened. Uh, I couldn't go to certain restaurant because they would not let me in. They thought I had to take drugs or drunk or whatever. Here in Thailand where I live, it's a different type of thing that happens a few times. Um, restaurants would not take me in because the karma. The Buddhist people think that I was bad in my previous life, so if I go into a restaurant, um, I will bother the other customer because I was bad in a different life, so it's bad for the karma for the restaurant. It happened two, three times, so it, it doesn't seem that it, that wherever I go in the world, there is some prejudice, and that's the way of life. I have many positive things also, because I have cerebral palsy, and I will tell you in a different way about the positive effect of having cerebral palsy. I think the biggest thing with prejudice is lack of knowing. People don't understand, they don't have the education, they don't see the big picture. It's only people with lack of knowledge. I have cerebral palsy. You can see my hands are not still. I talk a bit different. But they are prejudiced because you are black, because you are white, because you are a woman, be because you are a man, because you go to a certain church, because whatever reason. And I think every people have learned about this in different ways. You meet people you cannot connect with them. They cannot see you for who the person you are. But if you have the right people around you, it doesn't matter what other people think about you. I have many people around me, they understand me, and they really don't think me with cerebral palsy. Maybe in the beginning people think I'm different, but after a while I talk the same as anybody else. I have the same will to do things, I have the same problems, I have the same whatever in life that most people have, so I'm not different. Maybe I have more challenge to live a life a normal life. What is a normal life? I've been a lot to India. In, in India, in certain parts, uh, they think I'm enlightened. In Sweden, I have a disease with uh, different uh, things that the doctors say. I don't believe the doctors in Sweden are right. I don't believe the people in India are right, because I just see the world differently. I see the world from my eyes. I interpret my life in the way that I've learned how to live my life. Yeah, so that was the chapter two of which country should I live in? who don't have prejudice. This is day number 25.
of 30 Days with artist Michael Avatar, maybe it's 26, who will scan it. So, I see you tomorrow. Take care. Bye.